Right, there we are, just tidied up with a bit of blue tack to hold things in place. On the floor, oh, we'd better go to wide angle, would not we? Right. Let's forwards, backwards, show that again. Forwards, backwards. Right, left. Whoa. I just turned the steering rate down a bit. I think I turned it down too far. put the body shell on because I've got no idea which is forwards and which is backwards at the moment. Or I could put a big arrow on top. I'll put the body on. Literally just put it on top so I've got some idea. Forwards, backwards. <laughs> well, that didn't last long. Uh, um, don't want that. I just push that switch the opposite direction to find out what it does, and it make, makes it work like two separate ESCs. So that now just drives one side. And that drives the other side. So that gives you independent skid steer. And pushing that switch that way. I don't know if I can do it while it's switched on. Probably ought to switch it off to do it. But yeah, let's switch it off. Make sure that's gone all the way the other way. Yep, yeah, that's both now. So pushed. I push that switch to this direction and it separates it. So it's two ESCs, two independent ESCs and pushed that way, it's mixed. I've just realized there's no on-off switch on that ESC. On these other ESCs, you've got a separate on-off switch, whereas on that one, there is nothing. So you have to unplug the battery or have a separate on-off switch somewhere else on the car. Not a big problem, it's just that I've noticed there is no on-off switch. I mentioned I'd done something similar before. This is the one I did before. I think it's called FLX Microdrive or something like that. Um, same thing, tank steer or skid steer. Um, all this yellow stuff is 3D printed. So it's quite a modification to the original body. That's the battery case for a 2S LiPo. And that's actually a case for my SQ11 camera. And then roll cage over the top. That one's amazing to drive. So there'll be a link in the video description to that one. Thanks for watching. You'll always find more information down below in the video description. If you like this video, you might like this one up here. You might like to subscribe just here. Over here is my latest video on my channel. 
and down below is a playlist related to what you've just been watching. Thanks again for watching.